It all began in a joyful atmosphere in anticipation of the reason for the gathering. It was an occasion for the ordination of the general overseer of the church, Apostle Akin Weeks, as a bishop. Suddenly, it all turned sour as many worshippers were unprepared for the turn of events. Tragedy struck. The roof of the church auditorium, which was filled with people, collapsed, leaving many people dead and several others injured. Some eyewitnesses spoke to Channel's television. After the offering, that the prayer was offered by Bishop Mike Laju, the building from the center started cracking, and in less than a minute, the whole building collapsed. We move for the place that we see it for first time. We go to another place. So on the way we move, this thing for the state governor Udom Emmanuel was one of the guests at the event, but he escaped unhurt. Apparently disappointed and sorrowful over the day's occurrence, the governor vents his feelings. It's not a good thing, uh, and we are really, really devastated that this could happen. Uh, but at the same time, I pray that people should be calm. And let's actually assess the situation. Let's see uh, the casualties that we have. And then be rest assured on the part of government. We'll do everything possible to make sure that this will never happen again in this state. Governor Emmanuel does not stop there, but vows to set up an inquiry into the building collapse. Uh, assessing this in the face of somebody who's not an engineer, could see a whole lot of defects in the construction. Uh, we'll try as much as possible to make sure that we we'll bring those who were careless about this to book. The governor also took time out to visit those who were injured at the Ibom Specialist Hospital, where they are receiving treatment.